गाइस वेलकम टू माय चैनल आई एम संध्या एंड दिस वीडियो इज पार्ट ऑफ माय थाईलैंड सीरीज एंड इन केस इफ यू हैव नॉट वॉच्ड माय प्रीवियस थाईलैंड सीरीज गो हेड एंड वॉच राइट नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू लीव द लिंक हियर इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन एंड आल्सो दिस वीडियो इज पार्ट ऑफ माय डे 2 इन बैंकॉक सो आई हैव कवर्ड डे 1 यस्टरडे सो डोंट फॉरगेट टू वॉच दैट बिफोर यू वॉच दिस वीडियो सो इन डे 2 आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू ऑल द कूल थिंग्स दैट यू कैन डू व्हेन यू आर इन बैंकॉक We are visiting the original sky, sky bar in the world. This is the view from here. Cannabis is legal in Thailand, and uh, this is the first cafe that I'm coming uh, in. This is in Bangkok. It's a very cool cafe here. You're not supposed to roll your joints, but you can buy the stuff. Gorgeous jumpsuits and this uh, two piece is just three fifty baht. Restaurant is like really big, so it has two floors. I'm sitting on the top floor. So guys, I'm going to introduce someone special, and she's been my follower. She messaged me as soon as she saw my Thailand stories, and we decided to meet in Bangkok. So, hello, hi, hey, hello. Chandni stays in Bangkok, and she's here for a quite some time, like more than a year. Yes. So, and she is a vegetarian, so <laughs> you you know whom to ping, which account to follow if you come to Thailand, not just Bangkok. You come to Thailand, and you can ask her what to eat, where to eat, all vegetarian options. Go follow her account and also let me know what you think about uh, this food and this place recommendation in the comments. I'll try now. Okay. So only quantity is less. Yes. This, this is mutton, proper, and this is let's eat. Your choice is like a less very less. This is masala kulcha. Now I want to go back again. It's like it has a lot of Indian restaurants, a lot of Italian, German restaurants, cool places to hang out. And uh, what else you get in this area? All sort of. This is the busiest and the happening place here. We are excited because yes. we are visiting the original sky, sky bar in the world, <laughs> and it's in the State Building in Bangkok, and it's called Le Bois. Yes, and it opens at five o'clock. It opens till. Midnight till midnight. 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 So we are excited. I I actually bought a very nice dress to wear it, and look how I'm. <laughs> All thanks to Ray. I think men you should dress up. I think they should wear a collared shirt and a nice shoes. I don't think so. Shorts are allowed. So read out or call them and ask because they're very strict about the dress code. I'm finally here, and because it's just five o'clock, it's just two of us. It feels like so exclusive, and but in the night it just gets gets crazy. And in fact, you should come just before the sunset. It looks beautiful. You can sit by the bar. In fact, they have a standing bar. This is the view from here. Entire Bangkok, the hustling, bustling city. You can just see in the night; it will be really, really gorgeous. Down is the bar, and on the top floor is a Michelin star restaurant. You need to make a reservation. Seven thousand seven hundred baht, right. and they have a set menu, and this is how a Michelin star restaurant looks. So this is the table. If I would have come with a date, maybe I would have sat here and had it. The chef is Japanese, and they serve only European cuisine here. As soon as you get ticket for the skywalk, uh, there you have this camera. They will take pictures of you, and you can collect the pictures in the fourth floor. 
So this is where I am going for the sidewalk. Even go here, see. You can see the entire view of the city, and you can also use this to see uh, the closer view. So that is the skywalk. As soon as you enter, you will find the place to eat food and order drinks. And you can actually, after your skywalk, you can sit here. That was Skywalk for you guys and uh, you can stay as much as you want here and uh, I am ending my Skywalk trip with this Thailand coconut and uh, so this is, the, <laughs> this is the first time I am drinking this coconut in the highest altitude possible and uh, this view is worth seeing uh, either during sunset when it's clear sky and it's not raining or during the daytime um, uh, so I really wish I had more time when I come in the evening because this view would have been like spectacular so yeah, so I'm done with this and I'm going to my next place. So guys, at the entrance so where you take the pictures, you can actually come and collect them. So they're going to be like this. So you'll get 5 copies. So 520 baht. So you can even take the hard copies and soft copies is 400 baht. And uh, you also can buy um, different merchandise of the Skywalk. exciting <laughs> and a different and a weird place some of you will love it some of you will hate some of you will roll your eyes i am going to check out the lee cannabis cafe here that is just opposite the street feeling in my bones i can feel it in my bones. cannabis is legal in thailand and uh, this is the first cafe that i'm coming uh, in which is in bangkok and uh, this cafe's name is uh, leaf cafe it's a very cool cafe here, you're not supposed to roll your joints but you can buy the stuff. So they have different kinds of teas, so these are like a normal teas. And when it says it's CBD, that means you can have it and you will not get high. So you can buy the brownies. So they will tell you uh, what is the high capacity of it. And these are the prices. I wanna get high on you. So you have the popcorns. You have the brownies and uh, then this is the stuff to, to smoke the joints, the roll and these are three roll papers, three roll papers, lighters and everything. Again, I am not encouraging you guys to do this stuff but then this is a very cool thing that I found because when I went to Amsterdam, so Amsterdam also has like a lot of cafes like this, uh, so I thought I might as well check in Thailand too. Uh, so yeah, so I ordered um, 
uh, iced uh, CBD original and they assured me that I will not get high <laughs> because I have to catch a flight today. Bangkok is known for the best and cheapest shopping place. There are different types of malls here. One are the luxury, some are the luxury brands, some are the cheapest. But uh, because I have very less time, I'm only covering one mall, which is the Platinum Mall. Let me just go and check how cheap is this uh, is the shopping in Platinum Mall. cosmetic shop so these uh, nipple pads and nipple stick-ons are just like 100 baht uh, so they're like super cheap uh, compared to India so I'm just uh, buying a lot of them and uh, you have these um, fake eyelashes and cosmetics and all like for a super cheap price how much is this? 100 baht 100 baht so you have this 100 baht and how much are these? these? this one? 100 baht so all this nail art is uh, like 100 baht Gorgeous jumpsuits and uh, this uh, two piece is just 350 baht and uh, I'm small in India, but here I think I'm medium because everybody here is very petite. Uh, so, medium yeah, so size. they are checking for my medium size. Medium. So, guys, these are just 150 baht. I just love them. So, I'm taking two colors of this. How much is this? 350. This is just 350 baht. This is very pretty. So, they have these two colors. Very, very pretty. These accessories are like super cheap, like it's for 20 baht and these are one thing you can notice in the Asian countries so they use it as a mask holder like uh, you know how you put these uh, strings for your specs with them to not to fall so they use this and I'm thinking I should buy these because they look like super cool and uh, these are the earrings Shirts for men are pretty cool, like a beach outfit. So this is 490, and they also have this is for 390. Yeah, the prints are pretty cool though. Now come to check um, the jute bags, and they have like really cool designs. Um, so they are the smallest one is from 250 baht to 500 baht, and um, yeah, I'm not sure if we can negotiate here. So how much is this one? This is 490 baht. How much is this? Any discount? Yeah, 500 baht. Found this really cute uh, soft top. So look at this sock. This really very pretty. So you can buy five pairs for 100. And I really like this um, uh, this little lacy lining here. So I picked up like five pairs of this cute socks. This shop is a very very unique stuff and it's very pretty. And they have this beautiful pickup over here. Very cool designs. The shop is so unique, everything is like so, so retro style here. Guys, I'm done with the shopping and just outside the shopping you have this like, the street food places. And I ordered this five fat type of breakfast. This is so yummy, it's like so good. And you can also ask them to make spicy. I'm done with shopping now I'm going to hotel and you can go overboard with the with the stuff because I usually don't do any street shopping but then I only went I felt like I over, I went overboard and I don't know how much excess luggage I have to pay so mean be mindful of what you're buying uh, otherwise this is a very cool place and I really like the designs 
yeah so this is my experience of shopping and uh, i hope you really like this video and in case if you have not already subscribed to my channel go ahead and subscribe right now and also follow me on instagram on pink pebble 